All right, let's get Boyfriend Dungeon going here. And where's this? Just gonna just. I'm spotlighted today. Uh, why can't you hear anything? I wonder. Oh, now you can. Got it. I'm on the lookout for something. I'm lonesome, but I feel alive. Yeah, so it. I am not sure if this game is actually done by the same people as Dream Daddy. I don't think so, but it has like a Dream Daddy vibe. Like it's the same kind of thing. Um, so we're going to do a new game because as you can see, I've already started one. Yes. This game involves exposure to unwanted advances, stalking, and other forms of emotional manipulation. Play with care and take breaks as needed. I appreciate that. Thank you very much, game. Okay, I'm like really not optimized for game right now. What is, what is this? The mouse is so far away. Okay, my name is not gonna be Kim, first of all. What? There we go. Um. Mombi, always. I use, I'm gonna say she, her. Eyes round, heavy, sleepy, smiling, tough. Let's do tough. That's my skin color. Long hair, kinky hair, short hair, buzz cut, bowl cut, curly hair. Oh, I like curly hair, but it's gotta be red. Um, yeah, I like it. Are you ready to begin? Sure. This game sometimes sends you supportive text messages from a character named Mom. Is that okay? If you answer no, we will be I'm gonna say no because I found when I was like testing out the game that it was really annoying um, and not supportive. And that's not because I don't love my mom. I do, I love her. Uh, but it was just like a little much. I was like, oh, I'm trying to kill things, stop it. Fucking with me today. There. Okay. It. I. Uh, John is asking why is there a warning for that? I think it's it's just because it is really annoying, like very annoying. It, it keeps popping up at the top, like. I'm worried about you and da, 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 and you're just like I'm trying to like do something in a dungeon. So just leave me alone, mom. Okay. Final boarding call for Verona Beach. All passengers, please board immediately. Okay, I'm not gonna read all of them, just so you're aware. <laughs> Verona Beach. Okay, okay. like a pretty chill place, right? Um, and, and then I also thought that maybe the reason why they ask is because it's like triggering for some people, like they hate their moms. They, just, they don't want, they don't want like a mother in a game. And I, I don't have that. I would love my mom too, but some people hate their moms, you know? I don't know. I'm just speculating. Hey, welcome to Verona Beach, cuz. It's me. Jesse. Hi, Jesse. It's been a long 10 years, huh? Your mom said you'd grown up, but I had no idea. You're so much taller. Uh, who are you again? Oh, wait, no, I'll say Sorry, things. I just remember you as a little kid. <laughs> Cousin problems. Oh, okay. Thanks, Jesse. I was in college, and you were like in the fifth grade or something. Back before California. You know what? I just, just one second. I just want to turn the music down. The music is like blaring in my ears. What? Goddess shield? Hey, that's cool. What is this, a beer? Okay, I don't like bubble tea, so let's do... What is this? I'll do water. Doesn't matter. Come on. I'll show you your room for the summer. Cool. Thank you. I'm living with my cousin. And then the voiceover stops. I thought that was strange. I was like, what happened to the voiceover? <laughs> you can stay here till your lease, till my lease runs out in September. 
I moved out to live with my partner last month, so you get free rent. Oh, hmm. lovely. Thank you. Uh, plus, we'll have the whole summer to solve your little problem. Excuse me? Your mom said you hadn't gone on a date. It's, it's not, like, not in your whole life. Excuse me. It's not a big deal, but I'll do what I can to help you. It'll be a summer of love. <laughs> or if you prefer a summer of totally platonic friendly hangouts, those are good too. I'm not a pickup artist, but pretty sure I can teach you something about meeting people. As long as you're willing to be a little adventurous, you've come to the right place. Oh, I'm ready to, for a little adventure. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm down. Verona Beach is the town for lovers, so it's best to keep your eyes and mind open. Won't be the only thing that's open. Ah! I won't guarantee you'll fall in love, but a date shouldn't be too hard to arrange. So, what do you think your main problem in love is? I'm cursed. Hmm. Possible, but then it can't hurt to build up some courage. Curses take bravery to break, I imagine, so let's make you brave. The first step in love is finding someone with similar interests and talking to them. Uh huh. So, let's get you some confidence. There's a new fitness fad in Verona, perfect, perfect for meeting people and facing your fears. You have to have an open mind, though. Are you ready? I'm ready, Jesse. It's dungeons. Oh, I love dungeons. Uh... Oh, not sex dungeons. Though I, I guess there are some parallel. Uh, never mind. Don't think about that. You know, dungeons from like video games or D and D, like that, but in real life. There's been more monster infestations lately, so people kill kill them for money. Okay. It's great for building confidence and also getting a workout. Plus, wait, uh, hey, I wanted to ask, can I can you turn into a weapon? Maybe, can you? Nah. Nope. But maybe you can. Give it a go. You squeeze your eyes shut and imagine turning into a sword. Long and sharp. <laughs> you open your eyes to see if it worked. Nope, your hands are still there. Same old you. Oh, don't look so sad, cuz. You can do it, right? Me neither. Guess it's it doesn't run in the family. Transforming's big in Verona Beach. Around here, people like us are called wielders, at least around the weapons folk weapon folks. You'll do great. Especially after you get a combat lesson from a sword friend of mine. I arranged for this afternoon. You feel your heart start to thump heavily. Meeting someone? Already? Jesse's eyes widen and he shakes his head. Uh... Stop. Take a deep breath. It's not a date. It's a lesson. He's a bit of a straight edge anyway. Mm. Remember, wielding isn't romantic. Perfectly platonic friends can wield each other. Okay? I mean, there's something that's kind of inherently sexual about that, isn't there? Like, if I turned somebody into a weapon and then, like, handled them? No? No? Okay. The important thing is that you're stronger together. So whenever you're ready, uh, go out there and go to the mall. Hmm. The mall! Okay. Dungeons are apparently about facing your fears. I don't know. really know. Ask Isaac. He'll be waiting inside. He's a fencing teacher and a perfect professional. And in the meantime, I'll set you up on a proper date. Always check your text messages. Jesse goes to leave the ah. pauses. Oh, I forgot to give you a little tour of the apartment, but this is sort of all there is. All yours. I have ideas on how you could use the shelves and desks, but we could talk about that after you've settled in. Feel free to use the mirror anytime if you want to take try on some new looks. No pressure. See ya. Jesse leaves. Okay. Okay, so here's my phone. I have a message. Hey, Jesse, now I have your number. Don't forget to meet. Oh, also, I just saw on the news that there's a weapon thief out there. Weapon people are going missing. Stay safe. Okay. So I can craft stuff. I have zines. There's a mirror where I can change my look and then I can leave. That's all I can do, right? E. Okay, so here's my apartment. Oh, this is so weird. I'm not used to this. Okay. 
Here's the dunge. Dungeon fear. Okay. Mm. What's this? Oh! Oh! What's this? You find a long, thin blade. The hilt feels, fits nicely in your grip. <laughs> a man's voice vibrates from the metal and up through your hand, making you jump. You must be Jesse's friend. Oh! Hi, I'm Isaac. Hello? Pleasure to meet you. Enchanté. Enchanté! The pleasure is all mine, I assure you. Oh, good to know, Isaac. <laughs> but I am indeed in a stock at times. Eh? Forgive me for remaining in this form for now. Okay. Okay. What? It takes some effort to change shape, and I'd rather focus on the lesson at hand. Okay. Your hand on my hilt is as good a handshake as any, after all. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Keep your keep your minds out of the gutter, people. Actually, I'm going to stay in the gutter. I'm excited to stay in the gutter. Now, if you take a look around, you'll see we're in a mall. Yeah, I see that, Isaac. A dunge is a place you can confront your insecurities. Oh. Here, your own psychology will create monsters to fight. Oh, okay. I chose the mall because most people have fears that easily manifest here. In a mall? It depends on the person. Strangers, inadequacy, sterility, poverty. Ah, uh, fair. Everyone's afraid of something. Let's go ahead and look around. Let's see if we can find any monsters to fight. <laughs> Techie girl says, how big is the hilt though? Do you need two hands? <laughs> ah, good one. Uh, I don't, oh, I, I'm so not used to this, like, looking down like this. hi -ya! Hmm. Nicely done. Your form is rough, but you have strong potential. Ha! After 20 years of practice, I better have something to show for it. Hey, tell me, Isaac. Now, let's talk about that monster. It came from inside your mind. When I first started going to the dungeon as a wielder, I fought a lot of trucks. Trucks? Yeah, trucks. Strange it is as it is. I don't even hate trucks, and yet they manifested. There were they were monsters. Pickup trucks, dump trucks, dump trucks, even cement grinders. It's because I had some issues around masculinity and boyhood, probably from my father. Wow, we we stand a self-aware man. Or sword. Eventually I worked through that and killed a boss monster truck at Funkin. My point is that your phone monster could mean a few things. Maybe you fear connections to other people and it just means, okay, I don't need to be called out in a game, mm -hmm. thank you. Maybe you fear helplessness, crawling like a worm, the way it did. Or we'll figure it out the deeper we explore into the dungeon. So what if we die? We'll go as deep as we can today. If we get too tired and collapse, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isaac, you dirty boy. We'll still get uh, to keep any treasure we find. Hmm. To avoid fainting, look for beverages. Tea, coffee, that sort of thing. Keep your spirits up. You can hold up to three at a time and use them when you need them. How many? I have, I'm, I have energy drinks, so. One last observation. You can use the power of zines in combat. Ah. That's interesting. Press the zine button, which is Q. F and Q, F and Q. Uh, to use your dragon zine to breathe fire. Oh my God, I'm not gonna remember that. Q and then F to heal. Maybe later you can find a new zine or even make your own. Be sure to not always rely on them though, as their use is limited. Right. So be brave and let's fight as best we can. Together we can overcome anything. 
Okay. Oh, shit. Sorry. Yeah! What's this? Can I... No. This. This way. This way. Okay. Controlling... Controlling her is not easy. Ah! I don't know what just happened. Can I go in here? No. Oh, I'm, I didn't even notice the map in the corner. <laughs> hey, Tiger Sack. Hiya! Hiya! What's this? Oh, a sword. Hello! Oh! What's this? Okay, <clears throat> I'm gonna read it in my sexy voice. The hilt is cool, almost cold to the touch, but it quickly warms under your hand. The blade begins to transform. <gasps> oh my god! What's happening? Ah! Hello! Ah! <laughs> Whoa. Well, hello, you two. Name's Sunder. Hi, Sunder. Isaac Brooks. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Unusual to be here without a wielder, no? Yeah. To be honest, I'm not really sure how I got here. Damn. Last thing I remember Thunder. is someone in a cloak, chanting. Hmm. And now I'm all dinged up. <laughs> yeah, I bet you're dinged I up. I must have made someone really angry if they abducted me and chipped me, whoever they are. Wow. But my luck is turning around because here you are. Oh, oh I'm glad. To I didn't be think here. anyone like you would be in the dungeon. Who me? Yeah, you. <laughs> I'm not talking to the monsters, that's for sure. Okay. <laughs> there were other options. Oh, if you're into it. Maybe we can go on a date later. Would that be okay? Wait. As a sword or as a man? I mean, I'm into both. It's cool. Maybe together we can figure out how I got down here. Okay. I mean, who would leave me here and not keep me in their embrace forever, right? Uh, yeah, I agree. Who did it? Plenty of people are jealous of this physique, so could be anyone. Really. <laughs> okay. Now I'll just cut my way out of here while you two finish up your run. Here's my number. Oh, thank you. I'll text you. Bye. The damaged blade saunters away, seeming almost to dance. I'm dead. This mm. is fucking hilarious. He was knocked out, damaged, and imprisoned here? It's a dungeon. That's what people do in dungeons. Weapon forms heal quickly, as they are made from our spirits more than our bodies. Okay. Still, this is serious. I'll report our findings to the authorities. I hope the abductor can be caught. I hope so too. Let's keep our eye out for any other victims as we explore the dunge. Ah! 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 Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god, I'm gonna die! Get away from me! Ah. Uh. Oh my god, I'm winning! I'm winning! Uh, I found some wire, okay. Ah! Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> Yay, I leveled up though! Okay, um, Mombi is now a wielder level two. I completed zero floors. I found one vault and my love rank with Isaac. Wait for a date invitation? Okay. Oh no. You feel the paramedics gently bring you to the surface and back to consciousness. You're bone tired, but otherwise unharmed. You realize you're, st you're still holding a sword. And that concludes our first lesson. 
Would you mind releasing me? Do I have to? <laughs> I'm afraid so. Until our next lesson, anyhow. Can you change into a man because see what you look like? The bl- Oh, good! Okay. Oh! Oh, yeah! What's his name? Oh, he reminds me of, uh... Truly. Enchanté. Enchanté. Isaac. Lovely. It was a pleasure to train with you. Thank you. But I must get back to work. Okay. Bye. If I may say, your fencing style is rough, but has unusual potential. Thank you for that backhanded compliment. If you're interested in refining your form, come by my office. I have the gear necessary for lessons. Okay. Thank you. We still have no leads on finding the source of your insecurities that form these monsters. Okay. So feel free to call upon me in the future when you need a dungeon delving And there were partner. a lot of monsters that spawned in that thing and I didn't know what to do when they all killed me. Until next time then. Bye, Isaac. With a small bow, he strides away. What are these zines? Okay. Oh, I have messages. Oh! Who's- oh. Not you. Did you make it to the dungeon? You didn't tell me he was hot! Yet somehow you figured it out on your own. So, how did it go? Wait, don't answer. Let's talk in person. I'll be right over. Oh. A few minutes later. Hey, cuz. I heard you, uh, picked up Isaac. And he says you're a natural. We found another sword. Whoa, two swords in one day. What are the odds? Yeah. Anyway, I'm glad it worked out. Uh-huh. Cool. Isaac says you might be afraid of technology or change. Either way, I trust you'll work on it together. Even if you're not into him, it's good practice being normal alone with a handsome stranger? What the fuck? No, it isn't. <laughs> That's terrible advice. In case you know, you might get nervous at all about the idea. I'm not nervous. I want to be the town bicycle. As you open your mouth to speak, your tongue feels dry as a desert. You fall silent. Uh. Nerves are that bad, huh? At least you've gained a bit of confidence. Well, lucky you, I went to high school with the guy that runs a sword shop, and he's single. Oh, at least that's what Eric's online... Eric? <gasps> Northman? Eric Northman? <laughs> I haven't seen him in person in years. Hey, Mark. Uh, chair is working out great. Thank you for asking. I feel like a captain. Um, he might be the only guy in town who knows more about swords than Isaac, but I got his number. Jesse pokes his phone. Uh -huh. Ah, there you go. He's free for coffee. Are you in? Fuck yeah. Yes. <laughs> I know that I'm supposed to, like, this is ruining the spirit of Thirsty Thursdays, that I'm supposed to make it, like, the worst possible experience, but I don't know. I'm feeling frisky. That's the spirit. It's mostly a practice date anyway. Tomorrow morning, 11 a.m. Wow. Morning date. Interesting. He'll be at Kicks, the cafe just down the street. Remember, it's just coffee. Talk about dungeons. Get to know them. Yeah, dungeons. Perfect thing to talk about in the morning. Uh, this summer won't last forever, and you're going to meet more people sometime. So let's role play as some practice. I'll be Eric. No pressure. Just check. Okay, it's weird because you're my fucking cousin. Are you my second cousin or are you my first cousin? Uh-huh. I'm Eric. I'm sitting here waiting for you. What do you say? Let's make out. You try to say hi, but under your... Uh, okay, you start coughing. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe try to mirror tonight. This might be more the work than I thought, but it's okay. You'll be fine. Practice makes perfect. See ya. Okay. Thanks. That was weird. Uh, let's go for a walk. You wander around for a few blocks, find a nightclub. Fuck yeah, let's go in. Let's dance. Sand, you listen for a while. You notice, oh, hello, uh, watching you, but you're too shy to talk to her. Talk to her! Oh. Oh, this is like my first first date ever. Count to ten. Okay. 
Um, you get up and you walk down to the coffee Welcome shop. Welcome to Kits. Hi. Hmm. I think the man in the quarter is waiting for you. Please be hot. Please be hot. Please be hot. Hey, you're Jesse's cousin, right? Oh. I'm Eric. Oh, okay. Sure. Hi. Now tell me everything you know about swords. Do you prefer one or two-handed? Mm, I'm more of a two-handed girl. I sometimes like the speed of one-handed weapons, but it's oh a rush God. to use the heft of two hands. Go, <laughs> oh, Jesus! Sometimes like the speed of one-handed weapons, but in it's a rush to use the heft of two hands. <laughs> Oh, this is great. The entendres, the entendres are very thick. Hey, SoCal. He waggles his eyebrows playfully. <laughs> Ooh, waggles. I love it. Jesse said you're a dungeon crawling type. So I thought I'd offer my help finding a weapon. Can you become a weapon? That's not really for me. Totally cool if you're into it. Oh, okay. I wasn't shaming you. But my shop sells only pure steel. Some imported, some made on site. Maybe I could give you a discount to a fellow enthusiast who gives my blades a good home. Hmm. You seem like the kind of woman who appreciates fine craftsmanship. Yeah, I sure do. As a smith, I have an eye for it too. I take, oh my God, I can't. I take raw, dirty hunks of metal and with finesse and strength turn them into art. Well, I try anyways. I'm still learning. Video tutorials can only teach you so much, you know. Maybe someday I'll make something beautiful enough for you to wield. For now, here's a gift for a fellow craftswoman. Maybe you can do something with these. Okay. Plastic. Awesome. Check it out at the workbench. Oh, I have... Didn't I pick up wire? Yeah. Anyway, I should get back to the shop. It's a very interesting outfit that you're wearing. I'll give you that. Want to go on a proper date sometime? Maybe I need more frivolity in my life. Yeah, sure. Why not? Mm -hmm. Excellent. If you need a weapon, maybe I'll see you again soon. Ciao. Okay, ciao. Eric leaves. <laughs> you head home. Okay, let's see if I can craft something. Bracelets? Wait for a gift opportunity to give it to someone's spouse. Oh, I'm gonna give it to Eric. Eric looks like the type that would wear those bracelets. Oh, can I make anything more or? Okay. Dear Mombi, I'm available for lessons. I'll provide equipment at my office, Brooks Associates, if you wish. Sincerely, Isaac. Sure. Looking forward to it. You did it! You went on a date! How'd it go? I think it went well. Wait, really? I mean, I'm happy for you, but you still have most of the summer left. Meet more people before you propose. I'm not gonna propose. Fucking relax, Jesse. You're now infinitely more date experience than you were yesterday. Plus, I'll find you another date venture soon. I want to date weapons. I'll see what I can do. I promised your mom I would. You promised my mom that you would find me. Okay. So, I'm gonna find you someone nice. Chill and dunge for now. Or use the crafting table I left in the apartment. You can ha 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 ha. I'll let you know when you're- okay. Wow, this is great. What? You want me to look here? No, I, I don't want to change. Should I leave? Let's explore. I don't know where Brooks Associates is. Oops. Controls on this is very strange. What is this? A church? Can't go here. Can't go there. Okay. There's a plane. I'm very large in comparison to that. Oh, I can go sh- Oh shit, I'm stuck. Okay. Do I have money? Welcome! Oh, how much- Oh, I only have two dollars! Oh. 
That looks like a schoolgirl outfit. Okay, well, I don't have any money, so... Thank you! Oops, sorry. Okay, there's the mall. What else is there? There's like this huge mansion thing. It's down here. Okay, okay, go that way. <laughs> the art style is really cute. Oh, 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 oh! What's this? Shopping? I was not there before. Let's go on a date with Isaac. You stopped at Isaac's office by his assistant. Excuse me, do you have an appointment with Mr. Brooks? Yes. Well, hello. Mombi, you made it. Christine, Mombi is always welcome here. Listen, bitch. Yes, Mr. Brooks. It's good to see you. I was hoping you would take up my offer. Let's begin. Do you prefer foil, saber, or a <laughs> Uh, can I wield you? <laughs> mm -hmm. I can't teach well wielded. For now, take up the foil. Will you be quick enough? We shall see. Now, ready yourself. Don't mind the office equipment. I do this all the time. Oh, hello. He shrugs on his fencing gear with practiced ease. Now, stand up straight with your blade out towards my heart. Turn to regard me from the side over your shoulder and hip. This is the on guard stance. You're quite literally on guard. We'll begin with the basic movement. Looking into my eyes, advance forward towards me, front foot, then back foot. Hmm. hmm. Try lifting your toes first. Don't cross your legs. Now, in foil, you can also only score by hitting the torso. In saber, the upper body. But in the dungeons, you'll need to score points with... You don't need to... Uh, okay, whatever. I suppose this means that we should use epe... E, epe rules. Sure. Try a lunge. Okay. Feeling <laughs> awkward. Not bad, you have talent. Oh! What happened? Holding roll lets you counterattack. Holding roll? If used just before an incoming attack. What? What does that mean? Holding roll? Oh, looks like you've reached a new level of understanding, so now you can parry with me. The more time we spend together, the better we'll be able to fight together. Okay. Okay, parrying, blah, blah, blah. Wait. The, to parry in the dungeon, hold dodge just before the enemy attack hits to automatically counter. Okay. That's a special move only you and I can do together, so don't forget. You can also check out our parry in the combo details on your phone later. But for now, shall we take a break? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Uh, let's get dinner. Mm -mm. Sorry, but I have an appointment this evening. Soon, actually. Thanks for asking, though. Oh, for fuck's sake. What about you? You're a dashing dunge hero now, aren't you? Mm. What do your parents think about your dangerous profession? Do they approve? My mom loves me. I'm glad she respects your choices. It's heartening to know that such parents exist. Does your mother adopt? Mm. Huh. I do prefer life on the straight and narrow. Okay. One minute, please. Isaac! What are you doing? Who is this? Shouldn't you be working? <sighs> I said one minute, please. You can wait in the lobby. <sighs> oh, is this your dad? Mm. Yeah. Pleasure to meet you. I'm sure meeting me is probably the highlight of your week. Oh, fuck off, dude! Mm. I'm terribly sorry, Mombi. I'm... It seems I'm occupied. I'll text you. Set up our next appointment. You're texting now? What's next in your slumming schedule? Will you drink water from plastic bottles, too? Horrifying. <sighs> Are there any depths you won't stoop to? Eavesdrop. You hear Vincent yell about how low, having low standards and making disgraceful choices. Isaac responds too quietly for you to hear. You head home. Ooh, drama! 
Hey, Metzger, thank you so much for resubscribe at 40 months. My God, that's a long fucking time. Thank you so much for sticking around that long. Um. Okay. All right. So many men. Oh, hey. I'm really glad Jesse introduced us. Me too. You should come by Naked Steel? Our scimitars have scintillating curves. Special price for a special lady, what do you say? Yeah, I'll uh, see you there. I'll be waiting and hoping. Sorry we were interrupted, but do you care f for business talk? Uh, sure. I love it. I don't know. <laughs> Perhaps I'll advise you when I'm next audited, then. I'm not a fan myself. Maybe I'll explain how I got into this someday. Yeah, that's fine. Um, do I like dancing? Yeah! Yay! Come to my club, La Rosa. VIP. Fuck yeah, bud, I'm there. Okay, cool, me too. Just tell the bouncer you're with me. Yes, I feel so special. Thank you. Whoa, the hell? Okay. I'm so popular, holy fuck. Uh, gifts? Inventory? What do I have in inventory? <sighs> Escape. Alright, should we go to, uh, La Rosa? Yeah, buddy! Let's do it. Oh my god, this game is hmm? hilarious. I'm with Sunder! Sunder? Bouncer unclips the velvet rope and you step inside. Thank you. Sitting, Sunder is venting to a woman sitting beside. Bitch, who are you? Hmm. But I just feel a real connection, you know? Mm-hmm. Join the club. And without love, what's the point? Oh, hey, mommy. Do you believe in soulmates? I want to. Oh, did I say something wrong? Uh-huh. Me too. I just keep getting so disappointed. I'm not sure anymore. Oh! I don't know what just happened. Finishers cause enemies to bleed. Okay. They made it look so easy in the movies. <sighs> Romance has been dead at least 500 years. You know what this game needs? Vampires. What if everybody were... were they were... Not only were they... Uh, weapons but there were also vampires right like he looks like he could be a vampire anyways this is mandy she's my business partner co-owner of the club hi mandy charmed what uh, kind of sword do you turn into again <sighs> no she's a wielder i literally told you five minutes ago are you listening at all what did you nah. say you know never mind this is a good song it's time mm -hmm. to dance I'm feeling healed from my abduction and dunge outing. What about you? Yes! Let's dance! Tonight we dance like we're gonna die in 50 years! What the fuck? Okay. Uh. <laughs> what? We are. Whatever, idiot. Okay. Mandy kisses the bouncer on the cheek as she leads you and Sunder to the dance floor. Sunder mostly sways and sips his drink, but Mandy dances with abandon. You can feel the music pumping in your chest. Um, let's, let's do some Elaine. You take a chance and put your heart into every motion. Mandy takes it as an invitation to dance very, very close to you. Oh, okay. I'm going to get double teamed by these two. <laughs> Sunder smiles and leaves the dance floor in the direction of the bathroom. Mandy leans in, her breath warm in your ear. You should really be careful, little one. Little one. Ah. Sunder eats up lovers one by one. He seems nice, but he's double edged. How do I know you're not just saying that because you want him for yourself? Huh? I know you said you're looking for a soulmate, so believe me, Sunder isn't it. He lies and he's dangerous. Sunder's using you. 
Part of it is his addiction, but he's too selfish and violent to be a good boyfriend. Then why are you his friend? Uh. I can be friends with assholes, I just don't date them. Right! But I like you. You're sweet. I'm just trying to help. Be careful. Ugh. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Good luck. Okay. Mandy kisses you on the cheek and leaves. Oh. The crowd parts around a sword that seems to be dancing its way towards you. Mandy left, huh? Just the two of us now. Let's enjoy the moment while we can. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna say that she warned me. Hey. She what now? Hold on. We should talk about this while I'm in human form. I want to look into your eyes. <laughs> I'll just have to prove it wrong. Everyone's done things they're ashamed of. Okay. But I'm a good person. I'll be good to you. Let's just keep it casual. Oh, yo, yo. <laughs> Trust me. We'll conquer the dungeon and have a great time together. Yeah, we'll see. He just smiles and leads you back into the busiest part of the dance floor. You dance together late into the night until you're breathless and sweaty. <laughs> Eventually the night is over. You head home. Oh god, he called me cutie. Delete me from this conversation! Eric says, It's crazy Jesse has a cousin like you. He's a loser, or was in high school. No offense. That's mean. I'm just being honest. TTYL, hottie! Don't call me that, please. Haha, -ha, sure. This guy's a fucking idiot. Fuck Eric. Not even in the good way. Hey, cutie. Ugh. Sorry if I'm too flirty. You can tell me to back. You can tell me to back off, but this is how I am. Rose emoji. You're a good dancer. Is that code for something? Oh my god. Also, only if you want it to be. Heart emoji. No, that's not a heart. That's a rose. Let's go again sometime. Fuck you. I don't want to go on a date with you. I don't want to go on a date with Eric. Isaac is the only kind of semi-normal one. Like, honestly, the other two, they can go jump off a bridge. Okay, um, let's go fight. I'm in a fighty mood now. Cutie. Eat shit. Eh. Hey. Um. Yeah, let's go with Isaac. I haven't Remember, even... fearing change is totally normal. What are you- Mom! Jesus! Uh, which way can I go? Oh, there's, there's two enemies in there. I just have to be better at dodging. I'm not good at that. Ah! 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 Shit! Ah, shit! Oh, no! Ah! No! Oh, I'm so bad at this. But I... Okay. No, I don't want to go home. <sighs> Damn it. I, I got a hey you up text? Fuck this guy, man. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be mean. Can I be mean? Uh-huh. Heh. <laughs> 
picks or it didn't happen. I was just feeling extra sharp today. Oh my god. He's talking about his penis. <laughs> oh god. All right, I want to see how sharp you are, baby. <laughs> Oh my god, he sent me a picture of him in his naked sword form. Oh, I want to kiss it! No! <laughs> I didn't need to press that! <laughs> oh my god! Oh! Oh no! No! <laughs> I thought that I could edit it! How come that's not an option? Fuck! Now he thinks that damn it! <laughs> oh no! He thinks that I. I uh... Ew! 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 Okay. Fuck! Sh shit, fucker! Oh no! Okay, that did not go so hot. Shit. Naked s Okay, let's go deal with this idiot. I'm gonna be mean to him. The shop smells of dust and oil. You spot Eric behind the register reading a book. Oh, you came? Oh, Mom, but you came. Hi. I'm so glad you're here. Slow day? No, no. Uh, there were lots of customers here before. Really? Yeah. Let me give you a tour. Ew. Verona Beach knuckleheads mostly want switchblades and razors, but we carry the finest blades. Some even made on site in my private smithere. I also teach classes at Verona Beach College about the history of war. Of course you do. Hmm. Tell me, what's your favorite weapon? An S-Doc? Hmm. Interesting. A formalist, hmm? I do hope you'll let me break a few rules now and then. Ah. Wait. You mean a weapon person, right, of course. It's naturally fascinating wielding someone else in battle, trusting them with your life. Sometimes I wonder who Excalibur would transport into if it were a person. But then I remember Sun Tzu and Napoleon and Genghis Khan. People win wars, Mombi, not weapons. Weapons are just tools. Wielders make the decisions, the strategies, the tactics. It's not polite to say, and pure humans aren't superior, but the truth is we're better suited to leadership. Pure? Mm -hmm. Or whatever the opposite of hybrid is. Oh, are you like uh, a proud boy? <laughs> mm -hmm. I have a little project you might be interested in. I'm forging a new and improved kind of weapon. Way more fun to wield than that boring s you're to you like so mm. much. I don't know what to call the Supreme Sword yet. Name it after me. I interested, huh? For my next project, maybe I should make one for you. Ah. The Mombi Blade. Wait, what about the Eric Blade? It's quite the ring to it. You're a font of inspiration. Even though the blade itself really uh, doesn't really need to be fancy. Hmm. You just want to make a weapon with a little bit of intelligence. It doesn't need to, its own thoughts and feelings and baggage. Think of it, the ultimate weapon with all the tactical insights and none of the drama. So you want it to be mindless. No. Ideally, no. Ideally, it would want to be perfect tool, but in practice, yes. The perfect servant will always be more loyal than an equal. Damn. Okay. The sooner you realize you can only rely on yourself, the better warrior you'll be. Oh. You're one of those. Hmm. Now, what can I help you with? I'm offering you a little discount here. Uh... I just spent all my money. Thank you. That was all the discount you're gonna give me? Catch you on the sharp side, cutie. Stop calling me that! Uh, I think we need to kill him. Is that an option? So I guess now you see why I prefer steel weapons. Not really. I mean, there isn't anything wrong with weapon people. They're just not for me. 
I fucking hate this guy. Can't really expect a person to sit in a case looking pretty all day, can you? You could pay them. Right. Yeah. Right. Bye. Now what? Can I craft some more things? No? Okay. Um... Do I just have to go and fight people again? Oh, wait. What's this? Why is it... Uh, yeah. Um, sugar? Oh, okay. Don't text me. I never want to talk to you again. Why did, why, why did it have the... Oh, maybe because it has new items? I don't know. Are there going to be more dungeons? Because, you know. Hey, cows. Let's fight with this idiot. The Talwar. Him and his dick... I mean, his his steel picks. I can't... I cannot believe I did that. Ugh. I'm... I kind of wish we could go shopping. Well, can I go up the stairs or no? What is this M? Oh, okay. I, I see where the... Oh, I like this weapon better, actually. I get through here? Oh. Uh, okay, so there's two in there. Ah, I'm trying to heal! Damn it! <laughs> Fuck! Is there a way we could change heal to something else? And like fire, hold on, fire. Uh, no, I guess F. Maybe Q and E would be easier. Oh, yes, Hasil, thank you very much for the hydrate reminder. Suck also, so, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Techie Girl. I need to try that again, guys. I'm... Yeah, I like the Talwar. That's kind of a, a nice weapon. It's just you and me here, hmm? Ew. Nothing's gonna happen between us, let me tell you that. Wait, is it different every time? Like, I feel like I'm... Just... Am I losing it? I think I'm losing it. Ah! I fucking died again! Okay, I have to get better at, uh... I have to get better at healing. Does it just keep giving me... Um... Uh. Does it just keep giving me more drinks? Oh, it does. Sweet. Okay. I wonder where the monsters are coming from. My mind. Oh, there's like a. Uh, there's, um. What do you call it? This. Oh. I need to just get to level two at least. Music kind of reminds me of the Silent Hill movie, which I know Metzger is it's like his favorite movie ever. He loves it. Ah! 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 
I found sugar. This game is hard, man. I don't have any more! Shit! I think I'm okay. But I... Am I healing? Why am I not healing? I'm gonna die! I need, uh... I need... I think I made it. Did I make it? I think I made it to the second level. I'm gonna die now. Yeah, his weapon is way better. I like wielding his weapon. Oh, it is from the games? Oh shit, I'm gonna die! Yeah, bud. Oh, I'm gonna die, though. Uh, Hasil says, just throwing this out there. Huge Kitty fan. Love seeing the Live in London concert and seeing all the reunion stuff. Oh, I'm glad. Thank you so much for being here and for saying that. Appreciate it. Um, Chab says, I got to meet Jodell Furland once. She was cool. Talked, to, talked about the movie a bit. Yeah, none of the music was original. It was for the first three games. It was so good. I don't give a shit what you say. I love that movie. <laughs> I think it's just because I, I like associate. Oh, 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 I got a new boyfriend. <gasps> Hello? The hilt is wrapped in several layers of leather and double edged blade is chipped. Oh. What the hell? Could you not just like grab me without warning? True. You're right. I know tradition consent. is all choose your Consent weapon, is important. Consent is important. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. I'm sorry too. I didn't mean to snap. I just... I'm not sure what's going on. I was out at night as you do and then... Bam! I'm here. My blade hurts. Monsters everywhere. Shit. I'm Valeria. Nice to meet you. You were sort of. abducted? I guess so. And damaged, too. Damn. Normally, I'd switch to human form around, but I don't know you. I'm still recovering from whatever just happened. Okay. I'd rather play it safe. That's cool. And I'm certainly not going to put myself in a stranger's hands and let you use me. I will not do that. I can take care of myself. Mostly. I okay. could use some extra cash, though, so I'll keep in touch. Okay. Ciao for now. What's with the chows? What's with that? I got to see the Silent Hill band play the soundtracks for Silent Hill 2 and 3 in their entirety at the San Japan Con Convention with Akira y Yamaoka. Wow. I'm a well-known hater of the movie. Yes, you hate that movie with a fiery passion and I don't understand it. Want to meet up sometime? What the fuck do you want? Leave me alone. Who is this? Oh, Valeria. Oh. Yeah, of course. Nice. Wow, I'm getting all the dates. It's like a pan dream. Okay. Um, which way do I go now? This way? Or did I just come from this way? Nope, I didn't. And I'm gonna die if I go over here. So, can we go this way? Oh, what's this, what's this? Oh no, I'm gonna die now! Oh no! I died. He's <laughs> doing so well. Yay! I'm a wielder level three, but I'm an amateur apparently. Damn it.
You free? Yeah. See you by the pond. Yeah. I hope she transforms for me. Okay. Let's go on the date with uh, Valeria. Fuck. I don't see anyone. Oh, there she is. Hello? Oh! Oh! Oh. Hello? Oh, Valeria! If she had red hair, I would literally fucking die. Oh my god! Huh? Hello? Huh? Wow, I really didn't get a proper look at you in the down. Oh, I hope you like what you see. You're cute! Thanks. You're polite, too. Too little of that around these days. Thanks. By the way, thanks for meeting me in public. I know you're the one who rescued me, but I still don't know how I got down there. Or how my bike got chipped. In an ironic twist, someone's clearly backstabbing me, so I'm a little jumpy. Besides, safety first, just in case you're an axe murderer. Hey, girl, I would never hurt you. Physically or mentally. Huh? Though I suppose you're more likely to just turn out to be an axe. What? Not that it'd be a problem if you were. That'd be hypocritical given my own... She leans closer and lowers her voice dramatically. Situation. So what is it, you know? Your deal. You can tell me. I won't judge you. <laughs> okay. For... So something's gonna happen? Yeah! Oh, come on. We both know why you came here, what you're hoping for. Do we? See? Isn't it a relief to admit it? Just be honest. Yes. I know exactly why I came here. I like a lady that, um, you know, a man, who the fuck are you? Can I help you? Hey. V? Oh my god, it's V. Ooh. Yeah. Um. Okay. <sighs> but your story's too convenient. You're from out of town, a newbie, never dated before. You're also charming and apparently great at combat. Something doesn't add up. Nobody's ever called me charming. Hmm. Get to know me then. I suppose this is why I came to Verona Beach. New start, new friends. Valeria, come on. Walk into the sunset with me. Yes! Enemies nearby get confused when you roll out of sight. Oh, okay. So depending on who I decide to wield, that gives me different um, tactics or whatever in, in the dungeon. Got it. <laughs> Say la vie. Yes. Yes! Give her it! Yay! These are exactly my style. You have a good eye. Thank you. Ciao. What's with the chows? With one last wary look, she stalks away through the park. Yes! Valeria! On your way home, you find a rose on your door. Oh, I know who it's from. Eric? God! Go fucking away. Valeria! Valeria! Uh, anyways, I think my bleak. Thanks. I'll let you know when I can think of, uh, when I think of a date we can go on. Let's go to the dungeon in the meantime. Okay, I'll fight with you. Literally. Hey, what's up? Having a good day? I don't like you. I'm gonna go out into the into the sunset with Valeria and you and your veiled racist things will just stand out of my way. Funny, playing it cool, huh? A woman like you deserves appreciation. Fuck you! 
my business is doing well, so I'm generous. Come by my shop sometime if you don't hate me. Oh my god, go away. I hate you. He's the worst. The fucking worst. The worst. Can I craft anything more? What can I do with sugar? Like make a cake or something? Oh my god, sugar. Uh, all right, let's go to the dungeon. Yeah, let's play with her. Why not? She's my new B B F F. -f, -f. <laughs> Techie asks, "Can you block him?" That's actually a good question. Well, here we go. That's actually a really good question. Oh no! I'm getting better! I'm getting better! Look at that. So how come I'm back to the first floor? If I've already... Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! What's this? What is that? A marble? Should probably. Uh... Oh shit! There's another one in the corner here. Yes! Sugar. Oh, there's a fucking two of them in the corner. Yeah! Fuck yeah! You did. Now where do I go? This way? Sorry, this way. Level two! Um, yeah, let's keep fighting with Valeria. She fucking loves me. It's gonna be good times, baby! Woo! It's shooting like fucking. Hello? Where is it? Uh, hello? Here. I honestly can say I've never played a game like this. At least you don't have to fight the Mind Flayer? What? Uh, this way? What's this? Ah, no! I, why? It's a trap! It's a trap! It's a trap! Fucking rock! <laughs> okay, let's grab that and heal. Getting getting the hang of it, getting the hang of it. Just don't die. Oh, what's this? Raspberry liqueur. Oh. Okay. What the fuck does that do? Oh, did we just go in a big-ass circle? Wait, what's this? What is that? Huh. Reminiscent of Steinlin, but more poppy and mainstream. I kind of love Valeria. Uh, probably just a lazy knockoff. But it's possibly the artist... The art... Whoa. It's possible the artist is knowingly commenting on the commercial placement. It'd be nice if the piece were both pretty and honest. Both are essential. <laughs> she loves me.
No, other way, this way. More wire and more glass, okay. Uh, this way? Let's go this way. I would love to get to the third floor. That would be great. Why? <laughs> oh shit, there's more. Yeah. Okay, this way, this way, this way. There you go. How much money do I have now? $25. And I, I, shit, I don't have any more energy drinks. So we're fucked is what you're saying, basically. Unless I get more. Um. Yeah, we love each other. We're gonna... We're gonna go on a... Okay, we made it to the third floor! Wait, what does this do? No, no, I don't want to cancel. No. I... But if I... Can I not... Can I save here? Is that, op is that an option? Because... How the... I'm just gonna have to do all of this all over again. Ah! Quick, 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 quick! Get this! Nice. What about through here? Yes. What's in here? What's this? Bubble tea? What the fuck does bubble tea do? Oh. And then this. Money. Nice! Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yay! I'm doing things! Can I go this way? Shit! Ah, oh, shit! What is the flying tape? The flying VHS? Oh, this is going to make it a little bit harder, isn't it? Oh! Really? What's this? Uh, vanilla. Yeah. Yeah! Sauce! <laughs> um... So Kyle says this is there is no saving. This is set up like a challenge where you try to go as far as you can. Oh, okay. Well, this might go badly, but so far I'm doing okay. I've literally have never played anything like this before. So well, that's not true. That's not true. Maybe something like it a thousand years ago. Was Diablo like this? Can't remember. That's bad. If I were outside, this would probably melt before we could eat it. Huh? Oh. Ooh, sugar rush, baby. All right. Uh, actually. Oh my god, there's so many of them!
yeah. Lots of money. Like it. I don't like these big things in the way. Um. Uh. Can we go... I think I missed something. Did I? Didn't I? Hold on. I did. We have to go back here where there's two those two red dots. Just need to find them. Oh, I better be careful because I don't have um Oh, there's one. Oh shit. That's close. Ah, I need to. I, I didn't know that you can hit the um, the thingies, garbage cans, to get more energy drinks. Fuck. Okay. Well, like this. Anything? No. Money. So it looks like we're... Are we going down, down, down? We're going down, down, doody da dee dee da doody da doody da dee dee We da do da dee do 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 dee dee Alright. I'm getting addicted now. I'm, Valeri and I are meant to be! Yeah. Fuck yeah! Okay, listen! I know I don't look so good. I know, I know. Is there... Did I miss any? Shit. I haven't even used my uh, zines to do anything. I'm gonna die. Oh, wait. Feel like a break? Uh... Uh... No. No. Addicted now. Sugar, cocaine. Give me the cocaine. Give it. What's this? Yeah, we certainly do, Valeria. Massage chairs. <sighs> um. Uh. SoCal says, yeah, there might be a reason to bail out. That's what the elevator's for. I assume you lose some of your resources progress when you die. So it might be smarter to bail if you feel like you can't make it farther, but that's the classic setup of a road like rogue like Diablo has elements of this. Okay, yeah. Too soon it's over. You feel more relaxed. With a happy groan. Huh. Mm. Do you think the monsters use massage chairs to relax? Probably not. Mm-hmm. All those weird vertebrae need special massage expertise, I'm sure. Until we chop them up. Let's go. Okay. Uh, I have a couple, so... Wait, did it just... Uh, he Hold on. Did it just heal me when I used that? What's this box? Oh. Cupcake recipe. Oh, cupcakes. Oh my god. I would kill somebody for a cupcake right now. Ah, no, a challenge room. Oh shit. Uh, can I can I move? Can I get out of here? No, I can't. <laughs> I 
don't want a challenge. I'm good. Thank you. Oh. Am I stuck in here forever? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Shit! Oh no! <laughs> Wow, look at me, I killed a lot. Yay, I leveled up. Oh, I leveled up twice. Fuck yeah. But I died. <laughs> all right, let's see what all these losers have to say. Do I like museums? Yeah. Meet me at the museum? Yeah! Okay, where is the museum? This game is cute. Wait. Did, did I answer her? Okay. I love how the uh, the other guys haven't... They don't even stand a chance now. Because her and I are... John says, how does the combat in this game feel to you? Uh, uh, pretty straightforward, I think. I just have to remember to point the... Ma you have to point the mouse towards the thing that you want to... Like, you can't... You, the, Yeah. You have to point the mouse towards the thing that you want to kill. Otherwise... I didn't make that connection until now. Um, but it's hard, because if you're not doing that... Like, even if you're walking towards... The, like, you're standing right beside the thing, the white thing has... The white little cursor has to be pointed towards it. Otherwise, it's not going to do anything. So that's a little bit difficult to get get used to. You find Valeria in the lobby and she leaves you. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Glares daggers at one of the scouts. <laughs> she glares daggers. That's funny. Um, it's too perfect. Perfection is so boring. I don't trust it. Beauty is boring. Mm -hmm. Exactly right. Perfect symmetry. Leave it to the mathematicians, I say. Valeria guides you through the museum without a map, according to her whim. You feel impulse to give a gift, but you don't have anything to give. She talks about the art with intimate fondness, like their eccentric family huh? members. Just wondering if you could steal a painting from a museum, which one would it be? It's a loaded question. I know, they're my favorite. You never really thought about this before? I'd steal The Birth of Venus by Bougereau. It's in the Musée d'Orsay, ground floor near the <sighs> stairs. It's three by two. What? It's huge. It would be a crime to roll it up. You've thought this through. Huh? Well, it wouldn't... I wouldn't... Uh, it wouldn't do to get caught, would it? Probably not. I'd miss out on the a chance to enjoy my painting if I was in prison. Now, it's your turn. What would you liberate? Ooh. Klimt's the Kiss. A passionate and bold piece. Rather like you, I think. <gasps> well, thank you. I hate museums as much as I love them. The idea of them, anyway. Art should be free. Out in the world, not hidden away like this. <sighs> but Verona Beach isn't so bad. The museum's free and open to the public. Have you heard about the new mural at the at the mall? I would love a, like, artsy, super artsy girlfriend like her. She's just like, all I want to do is talk about art and, like, wear a lot of bracelets. Love that. Love that energy. People are saying it's the Rose of Venus, you know, the anonymous graffiti artists. Maybe they thought Verona Beach needed a little more beauty and love. Mm. Just as you're getting nowhere better, Valeria's attention wanders. Wait, it's the guy from the park! He, sta he looks like a fucking dirt bag. Like... Um... Is he your, like, boyfriend something or other? Like... 
Listen. I I ain't down for that. Ugh. Yeah, let's go home. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, cool. We have we have leveled up in love rank. Like I need to get to six. I can roll further now because of her. So what do you say? Hell yes! You take Valeria home to your apartment. <laughs> nice place. <laughs> She's confident and knows what she wants. She figures out quickly what you want too. Ow! After she snuggles into you, her hilt perfect in your palm. <laughs> Yay! You're warm and cozy and soon fall asleep. Ugh. In the morning, she's gone. Hey, that was a, 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 a great first time on like, you know, being a bad dad. If you catch my meaning. I love this game. I actually like it more than, than not big daddy, dream daddy. Oh, did I just get a you up text? You up? Morning. I want to see you again, but I need to think. Let's just dunge for a while. Okay. But does that mean I have to go all the way back to one? But now I have, uh, I can dodge further. Um. I found you another date. Oh, wet emoji. Yes. I'll be fine. It'll be fine. Don't forget to smile. I can't go, but fake smiles are bad. Never mind. Smiling optional. I can't. I've I've got a date with Valeria. Maybe should I go see Isaac or should I just keep doing Valeria? Because I think her and I have a thing and I'm into it more so than the dudes. And like Sunder Meh. I like his I like his sword, but this guy's just a fucking douchebag and I want him to go away. And I can't block him. Like, can I block him? Like anybody that says things like this should just be yeeted off like so far out there. Okay, so let's go back. Maybe we'll play with what's his name for a bit. The Talwar. No, but I love my girl. I need my girl. Oh! I can go to a different floor! Nice! That's awesome. But Verona I... Mall has seen better days, huh? Aha! Uh -huh. See that white thing? I am not good at uh, positioning that. I'm hungry. Oops, me. I only have one left. Uh, yeah. So does that mean I have to make it to floor five in order to have two elevators?
Uh, hello? Oh, what's this? Huh. They're ephemeral, always replaced by something newer and better. Yeah, Trav, they're flying VHS tapes. Not sure what that means. A Valeria leads you to a love tester. Yeah, let's try this one. It's one of the older ones. I think it uses skin conductivity. Two metal rods. Yeah. Um. I'm thinking about you and how cute you are. Oh, um. wow. Ah, we're too hot for the... She kisses me! Oh. Eventually, the kiss ends. Damn, it's a long kiss. Guess we have to get back to work, huh? We can't scandalize the monsters. She sighs dramatically. I don't- I need to get her a gift. Guys. That's very important. I need to get my girlfriend a gift. Otherwise, what's the fucking point, right? We need to get more energy drinks. Ah, there's one, there's one, there's one! Go there, go there! Ah! How there's just like holes in the floor. Um, did we make it to floor four? Yeah, let's do it. Fuck it. I know that it's dangerous, but. Ah, shit! Alright, we're, we're in good shape here. So... Get the fuck out of here! VHS tape! Cool! Did I just unlock something I didn't even mean to do? Oh no, is that no 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 no! No, I'm just kidding! I don't want to do a challenge right now. Oh, there's one right by the door. Liquid. Okay, what does that do? This is fun. <laughs> I'm actually having fun. <sighs> okay. Um. Wait a second. I've been here before. Haven't I? Or was that on floor one? Oh, a skating rink! That's cool. I never got, got the hang of ice skating. Um... It's fun, don't get me wrong. I just fall a lot. I hope you're ready. Hang on to me, baby. I got huh? it. Are you sure? I'd hate to bring you down with me, but here it goes. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, placenta. Eventually, you take off the skates. You feel an impulse to give a gift, but... You okay, yeah, I know. Thanks. I'm a terrible girlfriend.
I didn't even know that you could, uh, can you, can you do that with everything? No? Uh, a fashion zine recipe. I don't know what that means. Should we go this way? We need to get more hydration. Oh, no, no, no! I don't want to do challenge. Oh my god, there's so many of them! No! <laughs> Kid Street, welcome. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, so we gotta make sure that we make cupcakes for her. There we go. And what else can we make? Fashion zine, we need glue. And I need more sugar to make the raspberry liqueur recipe. So I've made a cupcake for her. Okay. So now we have some... I don't know, maybe she won't like cupcakes. Placenta, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Okay, we're going to floor four. Three. This is not as easy as it looks, okay? Um, it's nice that it's not so crowded. Damn it, I'm so bad at this. Did it patch itself? Okay, we're not doing that. We don't want to do the thing. I don't want to do a challenge. Or do I want to do a challenge? Oh, what's this? Yeah! <sighs> um... Uh-uh. Okay. Good. Yes! Do you think she's gonna like this? Maybe she's gonna be like, I'm vegan. Oh, maybe not. Companionable silence. Love that. Thanks. been here? It just looks the same. How rich I am. Oh no. Um, I need to find the um, an elevator. The elevator is is what I need to get to.
shit. This isn't good. We don't have... I just don't want to get to a challenge, otherwise it's going to be bad, you know? Oh no! Ah! 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 Oh no. Give me a thing! Oh, thank god. Oh, is this more wire? Shit. Can't go in there. Ah! Shit, they're right by the door. Ah, uh, no! Is this the elevator? Okay, something. Oh, there it is. There's, there it is. Nice. We need to get to, to level five, because I'm pretty sure that's, that's where the, uh, Is that a hat? A helmet? Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that! Oh shit, there's one more. Sugar. All right, we're good. We're in good. We're. I think we're. We're good. Is that the elevator? No. Shit. I think we're there. Is this level five? Yes. 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 Oh shit. Yes, we've made it to the elevator. So that means I don't have to do it. A key, eh? Shit. Okay. This is this is fun. I'm actually having fun. <laughs> I honestly didn't think I was gonna have fun playing this kind of stuff, but I am having fun. That's all that matters. It's it's less thirsty than I thought it would be. Ah! Battle my fears. Oh no. Why? What's my fears? <laughs> Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, I died! Fuck. Okay, now I, I'm sorry, but we have to go back. <laughs> e. We have to go back. But let's see what we can craft first. Because I want to give my girlfriend, you know, a good gift. Uh, anything? No? Alright. Oh. Mind meeting me again? I'll explain some things. Yeah, you want to explain about that guy? Here's a hint for when you find me. Thanks. Okay. What, what, what am I looking at? Okay. 
Okay. Oh, we're at the park. Valeria is sitting on a park bench, glaring at the ducks. Hey. Uh, yeah, I'm here. Hi. After how things ended. With what? I asked you to go home with me for all the wrong reasons. What? But I don't regret our time together. Not one bit. Oh. Um. I wish I had been, I don't know. I was, not at you. I could explain, but... Ugh. Hope you're not one of those people that feeds ducks in the park. No. <laughs> she hates ducks. Wait till you meet geese. Cuts you close with a piece of bread and then chomp. <laughs> Is that true? <sighs> okay, I may be exaggerated, but only a little. Um... Promise not to laugh? It didn't happen to a friend, it happened to me. Ah. Could I kiss it better? Aww. Damn! And you slide lips down her palm to her wrist. After a long moment, she pulls her hand back and smiles shakily. <laughs> You're uh, good at that. The sound of loud quacking interrupts the moment. I can't believe you did that in front of the ducks. Whatever would they think? Lesbos. I feel you feel an impulse to give a gift, but you don't have anything to give. Um, well, you know, I tried. I gave you a fucking cupcake. Next time we'll go on a date without the risk of a duck. I am killing it with her. Attacks do critical damage to confused enemies. Okay. Sure. Huh. Sure. <laughs> huh? Yeah. I dated him for a couple years. Okay. Um. And I uh, dated his sister as well at the same time. I mean, they both. Whoa! Whoa! Hold the phone. You dated siblings? How did that work? Um, like any other relationship, only with more talking and negotiating and mistakes. Okay, we were happy for a while. I was young and in love and I thought we'd be together forever. Jake and Jessica and me, three artists against, you are an artist, that's why I love you. We were everything to every each other. We had the same goals, believed in the same things, and then, Greed and pride and ambition got in the way, as you usually do. Jessica wanted more, more recognition, more adventure, more everything. And I wanted things to stay the way they were. We were foolish, foolish. nothing stays the same. Moved to Verona Beach, looking for a fresh start, and Jake followed me. Yeah, he's a fucking bum. Huh? <sighs> it happens. Yeah, 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 okay. <sighs> She got me a gift! Go check it out in your apartment. A beret? Love it. Thanks. But you know, I'd love to show you my work sometime. Oh, you've already shown me your work, lady. You know, my paintings, if you wanted? <laughs> then it's a date. I've had new inspiration lately. Ciao. I'll look for forward to the... Yeah, okay. This is turned into girlfriend dungeon. I'm just saying. Just saying. Oh. Okay. Before you come over, I gotta clean. I mean, it won't be clean clean. I'm not a nun, but this muffin from 2016 needs to be evicted. In the meantime, I found some cool art by the mall. Did you see this? Oh, I love murals. Maybe we can check it out together sometime. Okay. Let's do that. Let's put that, uh, can I put that hat on? 
Oh, I look so French. Looking good, Habibs. Okay, bucket hat? No. Turban? Yeah, I wrap. I don't think that's appropriate for me to wear a turban, I think. Um, can I wear this? Wait, this is more me. <laughs> oh, that's great. Wee oui, wee oui, Paris. Perfect. Love it. Um, guys, we have to go back. I'm sorry. We have to go back to level five. I've just, like, abandoned the guys. Don't even care about them. Floor five. Going down. Oh my god, I look so <laughs> Careful, cute! don't tickle my hilt. Tickle your hilt? I'll do whatever you want me to do to your hilt. Okay. Battle your fears! Battle them! F to heal! Oh, these are like super strong! What the hell? Did I kill it? Ah, it was still alive! No! <laughs> I almost did it! Fucker! Okay, now we have to go back. Sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going back. I love my little outfit. Four, five. Gotta face my fears. Oh, I was so close! Did you see that? I almost killed the, the giant uh, thingy. This feels dangerous. I like it. Good. All right, all right. Okay, so maybe I need to like stay out of its uh Oh no, oh no! Get get this, get this! Yes! F to heal! Oh, I'm gonna kill you! <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Uh, get out! Get out of the way! Yeah! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Hello? Oh, but I'm I'm like critically dead, basically. <laughs> oh, damn it. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, baby. Um so So does that mean I need to make it to floor 7? to get to the next thing or something. Thank you, SoCal, for the bits! I'm having fun. Didn't think I would, but I'm having fun. Uh, this is dangerous because... Oh, the fucking VHS. Me and my girl, we're best. We're the best together. Oh, what's this? All right. <sighs> it's 
hurting my lower back. Um, uh-uh. You sit together, blah, Thanks. blah, blah. Oh, okay, so I didn't even notice that it puts me back uh, to full whatever. Song association with dungeons? I can't even think of one song with dungeons in the name. I'll have to change that. Oh shit! Oh shit! Shit. Got a little crazy there. I think I can make the, um... The, uh... Thing. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Plastic. All right, and lots of money. Look at that, I'm fucking rich. Oh, another one. A sleepy time zine. Oh, that could be useful, right? Then I can f throw it at... Oh, wh where the fuck am I going now? Uh, we need to get to floor... Oh, I see where we need to go. Because I see something that I missed down here. Oh, can I? No? Can I use this as like a save point or whatever? No, it only used one time or worked one time. We need to get, oh shit. Oh my God, they just come right at you, don't they? Oh, there's a big daddy. Ah, there's a big daddy, oh my God. Oh no, oh no, oh no, shit, shit, shit. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Oh my god, am I gonna die? I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Oh no! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I'm sad. I need to make it to floor seven! Okay. I'm gonna try again. Can I craft anything? What is that? Like a yoga mat? A racing game recipe? Okay. I have to try again. I have to. Determined now. How dare they? Is there just the one dungeon and that's all my fear of change? It's accurate. This feels dangerous. I like it. Uh huh. Sure, you do. Like a break, yeah. Huh. Okay, blah blah blah, blah blah blah, blah blah blah. We've already 
Yeah. Yeah, she, she doesn't like lying. I don't have anything to give her. I'm fucking rich. Okay, let's go this way. Oh shit! What does the liquid do? Can I use this at any... No, I already tried that with the other thing. Let's go through here. Oh no, this is where I died the last time! No, 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 no! no! Ah! <laughs> Okay, if we can do this, if we can get to level seven, I will be very happy. And we will end there. Because I'm hungry. Uh, where are we going? There should be the stairs soon. In there? A bucket? Like a bucket hat? And some cash? How much money? How much? 70? Right. And plastic, okay. Where is the... Oh, here? Okay. This way? Yes, okay. How are we doing? Oh, fuck me! Jesus Christ! Where did all these fucking things come from? Oh my god! Uh, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> Fucker! I'm, I'm sorry. I know I said, I know I said only one more try, but I can't not try. Anything that else I can craft? Okay. I can't not try. I'm almost there. Damn it. It's nice that it's not so crowded. I need to get to that, like, crazy, uh... Are we gonna use this spot? <sighs> okay. Huh? Mm-hmm. Here, here's the, the crazy one, right? Alright, let's go to these. Oops. What is that? A business suit? time that I, I am not being punished for pressing E. Right? Right, John? There's no planes to fall out of. Um... Oh my god! Okay. Oh, shit! Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Can we... I don't want to go do the challenge. Should I do the challenge? 
Hey, two real. Uh, sugar and plastic. I see stairs, but how do I? Is it stair? Is that the next floor? No, because I need to find that crazy room that I keep dying in. So, ah, uh, oh, shit. Or maybe not. Maybe that is uh, level six. Yeah, maybe it is level six. Okay. What the fuck? It's gonna be a challenge room, I know it now. Wait, what's this? This? Yes, okay, this is the crazy room. Okay, pray for me. do it no no we didn't do it but we're getting closer wait there's something in the corner if i could stealth him that'd be great yes yes we made it to fuck's sake this one. we made it to floor s we made it to floor six we made it to floor six did we we're good we got all of the things okay I think we did it. I think we did it. We did it! But we need to get to floor seven. Uh. We need to get to floor seven. This is gonna be hard. Oh, shit. No, 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 Oh my god, what are those? Oh, Jesus! Yeah, baby! Oh, there's another crabby phone thing. This is not gonna work. <sighs> okay, stabbing monsters. Mm-hmm. Okay, Thanks. okay, nice. Alright, perfect. So... I have so much wire now. Okay, we're good. We're good. I think, we, I think we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it to, um... We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it to the... Seven floor. It's all gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Can we? Oh, what's this? Oh no no no. What is this? Oh no no no. I don't want to. I don't want to do that. I just want to get to floor seven and then we can do that. I'm scared. Oh, I'm scared. Oh shit. I'm stuck, I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! Oh my god! 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 Shit! Shit! Oh my god! Oh, they're ganging up on me! No! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Oh my god. Come on, give me something to heal with, fuckers! I. <laughs> no! But at least I'm a level nine.
<laughs> they they cornered me. Ooh, I can craft a racing game. What was the other one? Raspberry Liqueur. Let's do that. She, she'll like that. Okay, and then racing game. What else can I craft? Is that it? A bike helmet? A chemistry zine? Sure. Uh, equip it with your zine shelf to get a new dunge ability. Okay. What's that? Throws a mind trap. 20 experiments you can do at home. Well, that's interesting. I, I think I like that better than the fireball thing. <sighs> what do we do? I think, I think I'm good. I, I, I feel like this could go on for hours. <laughs> Just me trying to get to level seven. I am curious to see, no, because it, it seems to go every other is where it saves. So uh, I'm gonna stop it. I'm gonna stop it there and just and just let it ride. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm really enjoying this game, actually. <laughs> it's not really a thir as thirsty as I thought it would be in terms of like a five dates, obviously. But uh, it's it's pretty it the the it's pretty thirsty. <laughs> it's pretty thirsty. I'm really liking it though. I think it's it's super fun. So yeah, good that I went out of, outside of my comfort zone and tried something new and I really like it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I, I, I'm digging it. Anyway, um, I guess I, I hope it saves. I don't know. I can put a god, a god mode on. Interesting. Um, but I won't do that. No, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Okay, guys, I'll put it over here. Uh, if you're watching and you don't already follow me, please go ahead, hit the follow button, turn on notifications so you know when I go live next. I shoot on Thursdays and Fridays, 6.30 Eastern Standard Time. Tomorrow, we'll be continuing on with Mass Effect Andromeda. Uh, two ways you could support the channel. You could subscribe, which gives you ad-free viewing and access to my Discord. Um, I think we... Uh, Hold on one second. Let me exit out of this first. I think... Uh, okay, you're just going to hear this <laughs> music. Sorry. Uh, if you... I, I don't know if we had uh, anybody... No, we did. We had um, Techie Girl. I'll give you the uh, Discord invite. I'll just put it in chat. I mean, if you if you want to join, you have to subscribe, and you're not going to be able to see anything if you're not a, sub a sub, unfortunately. But um, I'll just put it in chat so you can join if you're still here. Um, yeah, there's that. But anyways, um, tomorrow again, we're going to be playing, continuing on with Mass Effect Andromeda with the main story. And yeah, I hope to see you there. Thank you so much for spending some time with me and we'll see you tomorrow or whatever. Okay, bye.